Yes, today we will introduce you to a gecko fossil. It is a 206 million year old fossil which was found in China. Geckos have a unique feature. They can attach themselves to every surface, for they have 2,000 tiny hairs on their toes, which split into 1,000 tiny hairs. Geckos have toes that have 2 billion tiny hairs overall, and they can attach everywhere. For how long has this been? Looking at this fossil, we can tell this, for 206 million years. For instance, when we look at this fossil attentively, we again come across with the same fact. It is no different from the gecko in our day. That is to say, the gecko, which lived 206 million years ago, was also a gecko that could attach itself anywhere, like the ones living in our day. This detail on the tip of the gecko's toes is a manifestation of Allah's wisdom. That is to say, it shows Allah's wisdom to us. This fossil that you see in my hand right now, it is a gecko. Does it live in our day? Yes, it does. Do we examine it? Yes, we do. This reveals to us the following. It has a ready-made program for itself. Its own DNA, its body, does not belong to it, for wisdom, technology, and might only belongs to Allah, the Lord of the worlds. This living being does not have the power to accomplish this. Indeed, even human beings, who are known to be the most intelligent living being, cannot develop such a technology. Today, we learn how a gecko can attach itself to every kind of surface from the gecko itself. We are unable to develop such a technology. Indeed, this is such an advanced technology that NASA scientists have based their research about how to strengthen the contact with the moon's surface and the astronauts setting foot on it, the spaceships or the equipment they use on the moon's surface, all on the information gathered from the gecko's bodies. In brief, living beings lead the way to science. From the paleontological aspect, for 206 million years, there has been no change in geckos. That is to say, there is no evolution.